when my uh, neck pickup broke. It just stopped working and I'm not sure why and I didn't really feel like dealing with it. I just thought this is a good opportunity to uh, put a Esquire pick guard on it and do a Esquire wiring on it. But I didn't want to figure it out myself, the wiring part. I tried it before and it was very confusing to me as to what needed to be on there. I remember that and I said, well, I remember Emerson having a kit that was uh, pretty tight or like, you know, it's custom wired. Figured I'd let them give it a shot for me and then I got it today and I um, honestly the install was pretty freaking easy um, even if I'm using tools that aren't necessarily the right tool for the job I'm using this file to screw in my knobs just had to solder two wires that was no big deal the diagram was pretty straightforward I mean it's not a big job it was a very easy one and I enjoyed it and I like I like the sounds that it has now it's pretty pretty freaking tight First position passes over the tone knob. The second position has the volume and tone. And then the third position has uh, volume and fixed tone cap. For the soldering, really straightforward, just preheat. And then you gotta make sure to moisten your sponge. Because if you don't, and you need some water to cool it down a little bit, maybe it's soldering too hot, then you're kind of effed in the teeth. And then let it cool down before you put it away. It's pricey, but hand wired in the United States. Um, I think it was 120, 100 and some odd dollars. It was easy. This was easy. It was easy. It would have taken me probably seven minutes if I hadn't, if I had done everything right. But instead, I think it took me like 15. No big deal.